yeah, that kind of uh, lead guitar business is kind of a cliche, but uh, I love it. It sounds, well, I'm thinking about a B chord here. Hanging out the seventh fret, think about the B note. Seventh fret, right. Make the chord, and then you're kind of lined up for the um, the feast of delight here. It's uh, something like that. So I'm gonna take my index finger, lay it flat on uh, the first and second strings like we always do. Seventh fret, good place to start. I'm gonna keep them there for a little bit and I'm going to bend the third string, ninth fret with my ring finger. And then play the second and first string. So it's third string, second string, first string. Then I did a little pull off. Uh, tenth fret, second string to seven. Because this finger's right there to catch it at the seventh fret. And then if I want to go back and nail the first string, seventh fret B. You can put little different feels and rhythms and swings and things to it. It's really great. Uh, you could try some hybrid picking. Or thumb index middle. Seems like my issue is how fast I can pick. I don't want to embarrass myself by trying and failing horribly this time, but I'm sure I'll embarrass myself in other ways soon. But that's just a basic stock lick. And uh, of course you can move it down to A, G, F sharp, F, did you see that spit go flying? Okay, E. Open strings rule, or E up here. On the first hit, I'm hitting two strings. I'm kind of getting into this. How about an A at the 17th fret? I'm kind of changing a little bit. I'm forgetting the last... kind of cool to take that note out. So yeah, you can delete or insert more notes any way you want to do it. But that's a good foundation lick. And if uh, your fingers absolutely don't do that, then you got to work on your dexterity business. I work on it every day, and uh, at age 62, I'm making progress. By the time I'm 90, I'm going to be pretty good. 